we have two separate entities. Binance.com is a global entity, which no longer services Singapore users, which never really did. And then Binance Singapore is still in operation, still servicing Singapore users specifically, and is going through the licensing process. Um, some of the other things we're doing on the regulatory front, I think right now the uh, regulators around the world are paying attention to crypto. And when they pay attention to crypto, they we are one of the largest players in globally. And of course they look at us. So we have taken the uh, a lead in example of some of the regulatory uh, compliance measures. We A couple, two weeks ago, we implemented mandatory full KYC on all of our platform, all of our services. So if you register, you have to KYC first. If, if you want to use any of our services. Um, this is a step that's relatively well, uh, very well, uh, very well welcomed by all the regulators around the world. Um, <clears throat> before that, um, we take, uh, we, um, we limited uh, certain products in certain regions. For example, we limited futures in the UK, um, Italy, Germany, et cetera. And um, uh, we actually um, have a lot of other things in the pipeline, but I think Overall, the sentiment is uh, the situation is regulators are paying attention into this industry now. And given that we are the leader and we are the largest player, they look at us, at us first. Um, it's bad from the perspective of PR, but it's also good that we can help shape the uh, regulatory neg narrative. Um, and we're working with U uh, Ukraine government to issue the bill uh, to on their bill, and we did consulting services for them. So that's uh, that just got released last night. So um, yeah, we're doing a, a very large number of things. I can go on forever. <laughs> yeah. No, you are. Uh, just coming back to uh, Singapore, uh, Chang Peng, good morning to me joining in this conversation. Um, where does the licensing process stand as of now? Or how much are you engaging with the MAS uh, to get that clearance? Uh, uh, and are some products uh, you know, on hold as of now? Yeah, so um, the uh, licensing ap application is still ongoing, and we have ongoing dialogues with regulators uh, in Singapore and all around the world as well. So, um, and uh, in most licensed jurisdictions, the um, the current licensing regime always have restrictions on what kind of products you can you, you can you can offer, and in most jurisdictions, um, uh, the uh, it's a somewhat relatively limited set of features you can offer. So mostly just spot trading. Um, Etc. So, uh, but it does offer a good fiat on ramp. So now you can. Uh, so it does offer a, a proper SGD on ramp or a fiat on ramps in other places. So uh, yeah. So um, yeah. Uh, we're just going through that process.